Hola amigos, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am coming to you from the Hay Literary Festival which is held just outside the town of Hay on Wye on the border of Wales and England. If you haven't been to my channel before, my name is Emma Bennett. I am a UK based writer. I write contemporary romance and the occasional children's picture book. I am so excited to be at the festival today. My family and I have been visiting pretty much every year for about 13 years. I want to say something like that. Um, we couldn't come in 2020 and 2021 obviously but um, now that everything is back up and running again it is wonderful to be here and it's going to be so fun to show you guys around thank you so much to the festival organizers for having me here i've got a couple of talks to go to today in fact i'm going to have to be off in a minute because my first talk is going to be starting so i'm going to go and listen to Catherine may i read her book wintering a few months ago in the winter i believe and i really enjoyed it so i am so looking forward forward to hearing her speak but there is loads to do around the festival as well as just going to the talks in fact sometimes it's just really nice to come especially in the evening just to hang out um, see you know all the people going about um, have a nice drink a nice coffee or they do a very good hymns or so I hear um, it's a lovely lovely atmosphere here and there are plenty of stalls and things to see and do so yeah i'm hoping to have a really awesome day and i will catch up with you later so catherine may was completely amazing if you ever get a chance to hear her speak live definitely try to go really really great very funny funnier than i thought that um that she would be um yeah but i'm starving now so gonna go and get something to eat now it's time for the serious business of the day book shopping so there's the festival bookshop which i'm going to go and have a look in in a little bit and that's awesome because that has like all the books by the authors who are coming to the festival and talking here but then there's also the second hand bookshop the oxfam charity bookshop and that's my favorite i'm going to go and see if i can find some bargains in there very glad that i brought an extra bag with me It's time to check out the festival bookshop because it's gonna be so cool. Guys, that's Cressida Cowell. That is the Cressida Cowell just behind me chatting to people. Like the author of the How to Train Your Dragon books. I am completely fangirling right now. So this is like the book talk section um, and there were so many good books. Look, Cersei, we love Cersei. What else do we love? Oh, that one I was not as impressed by Clara and the Sun as I thought I would be actually. But I thought it was quite cool that Beach Reads was here. I enjoyed that one as well. What else do we have? Oh, oh, this is the house. Um, in the Cerulean Sea. If you haven't read that one, definitely do. And Midnight Library as well. That's another really, really good one. There are just so many good books to choose from here. I'm definitely going to get something, but I don't know what yet. This is my favourite bit of the store. It's the signed copies bit, but I don't think that there are any signed copies left of the book that I wanted. It's the book on Agatha Christie. It's an autobiography of her by... Um, Lucy Walsley and I've seen copies of it on another table but I think that all the signed copies must have already gone because she was here speaking a few days ago so I think they've probably sold out <laughs> Hi guys, I'm having a little bit of a chill. We went to the second talk that we were booked into, which was more like a sciencey thing. I found my pink deck chair, pulled it into the shade because Irish skin. Um, and I am reading The Convenient Marriage, Georgette Heyer. Um, I'm not enjoying this nearly as much as I thought I would, to be honest. 
Um, I am wanting to hear about the romance between um, what's her name, Hori, Hori Winwood, and and Rule. Um, but it seems to just be everybody else kind of talking about them, and Hori is being really annoying. So, yeah, a weird one. Um, yeah, I'll finish it for kind of you know finishing and um and i'll chat about it a bit more anyway so yeah so the problem with having a husband who is a doctor of nanotechnology is that when you say to him make sure that you bring a book with you to the hay festival for in between talks so that we can have like a little read is that he gets you to lug around all day in your bag roger penrose's the road to reality yeah um this thing this must weigh i'm not exaggerating two kilograms seriously and that is what i have been lugging around because he doesn't bring a bag with him because i'm the girl therefore i have the bags so that's fun at least if i kind of swap it around either shoulder then you know i guess i'm working out both sides and i have brought with me my am i going to be able to show this properly my Joffy as in coffee book that my publishers sent to me my publishers Joffy books so that's super cool it's the first time I've used it and I think I have actually already got coffee on it because if there is a way to spill something then I definitely will spill it um, this has been such a fantastic trip to Hay I have to say um, Hay is wonderful whatever the weather but there is something extra special about the Hay Festival when the weather is beautiful. We have been here in all kinds of weather before. We have been here years when it is like a quagmire where they've had to close the car parks because the car parking is in fields around the festival site and they just got way too waterlogged and so you had to go and park miles away and then there was like a shuttle bus and that's still fun but you kind of have to keep to the walkways and things and obviously you might get a little bit wet they are very good though there's lots of undercover areas to eat and stuff like that but when it's sunshine i mean the sky is just so blue today and it's absolutely perfect it's not too hot it's not too cold there's a gentle breeze this is absolute heaven i kind of don't want to go back home i'll be honest with you i think we're gonna hang out here for a little bit more yeah basically until they chuck us out i think well, thank you so so much for joining me for this little vlog today i really hope that you have enjoyed seeing around the festival with me and if you haven't been before maybe this will encourage you to come next year and you never know maybe i'll bump into you maybe you'll be another youtuber and i'll spot you and be too nervous to introduce myself like i was with Cresta cowell earlier and i'll just creepily film you like i did her wouldn't that be fun Anyway, please remember to like this video if you haven't already and subscribe if you're not because we do have a lot of fun on this channel and I will catch you in the next one.